Here's the books you've been reading for the past week. Starting with the books we read for school. We're reading Ziggy, Zebra's Alphabet, Rhyming Alphabet. Highly recommend this. It's a rhyme, uh, it's a rhyme for each letter of the alphabet. It's for the pre-reading level set. We're reading he Here's a Penny, only on chapter 3, so don't know yet if we like it, but here's what it's about. We use the picture dictionary for the weeks that bookshop does a letter a week. My son learns new words and we talk about them. I mean, long ago, so highly recommend we long ago. The graphics are still cold, lots of reading. But the pictures so make up for the reading. We've been doing this Mother Goose book this year. We did one last year with their pre K set and we're still loving this one and the pre K one. Thinking about doing poetry tea time, not with tea, of course, my son can't have tea, but you can do poetry kind of like tea time in the summer. We're no longer doing Bookshark just to use the poetry books we have. These are the books you've been reading. You got this at a used book sale when my son was real little and he still loves it. It's Nightmare Before, it was The Night Before Christmas by Little Critter. Cute little book. We've been reading some Halloween books again. Mickey Mouse Halloween Trick or Treat. He loves the Lift the Flat books. This one is also a Lift the Flat books, a handy helper. I'll show you this one. It lays flatter. But anyway, I use Ed McKay's actually. I wish they still had Ed McKay's. We got the race for the big attorney. It came with some cards to each character on it, and you read about a race. Think doing all around, you follow a turkey, you have to put the flat book and you follow a turkey around looking for him. You put a sign of Thanksgiving, it's pretty cool. This one is called a special Thanksgiving. The town puts together a special Thanksgiving so that everybody in town, from the very poor to the very rich, all help out to make a really good Thanksgiving for the town. But it falls about fall weather. Kind of cool. Here's another Thanksgiving book by Biscuit. I highly recommend these Biscuit books. My son does the woof woof part. We have the mini mouse and the case of the missing sparkler. Cute little book. It's got pictures for the it's got pictures for each of the words. It's a pre-reading level, and here's their level one reader. Mini Rella. It's about Mickey and Minnie and a version of Cinderella. I sound a lot of fairy tales, so I get them different versions every time I see them. So I think you should know different versions. I don't just get them uh, Disney versions. I get them like classic versions and everything. We read Biscuit Goes Camping. It's a cute little book about going camping and, uh, and stuff. We read Biscuit Goes to the Library. It's a cute little book. Uh, Biscuit ends up picking out a book about a dog named Biscuit. See? Isn't that cute? Uh, we read Spot's Magical Christmas. I got this one at Goodwill and love it. We read it every year. This is Jambet's Christmas Treasure. No, we did not read all. The books in here we did, however, read her version of The Night Before Christmas. See, I love how she, how you, here's the main story, but then there's stuff going on on the sides. I love that about her books. I highly recommend this big treasure of her books. If you ever see it anywhere for, for sale, buy it. We're also reading Logan's Puppy. We're on the last chapter of the Dr. Kitty Cat book, book seven, and it will be on book eight. We read this at bedtime, so it's slow going because we only read at bedtime, but we're loving them. We already, read, we already read the other six books, and we highly recommend these. It's about a, a doctor who's a kitty cat who saves animals, and each theme is, each book has a color theme and an animal he says. I am reading this by myself. The house with a clock in the wall. I am slow going in it because I only read it on weekends. I don't have my son because I'm too busy reading books to him. So these are everything we've been reading this week. I highly recommend all the books I showed you, except for this one I'm not really sure about yet. I might know next week, I'm not sure. I'll let you know. 
Have a great weekend, great Thanksgiving, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.